Hey, a pleasant good day, everyone. This is Sports for Night News. I'm Joe Borick, and this is going to be a quick video on the Washington Capitals getting a nice little mini waiver claim of Dennis Shalowski, who was, of course, on the Detroit Red Wings last season and now is coming over from the Seattle Kraken in the expansion draft. And he adds to the good depth that I talked about on defense that they already had in Matt Irwin and TVR because you guys already have a pencil in it. Five guys in fear of Ari if he continues to develop the way he is. Carlson, Orloff, and Jensen, and Schultz pretty much each night. It's just about that extra defenseman. You already had Matt Irwin and TVR to try to fit into that mold and see how well they can do. Now you just add another cat, so you have three guys. So it seems like you obviously have a good chance to figure out who's going to slide into that spot for the entire season with Justin Schultz. And there's a good chance it could be Dennis Shalowski because he can push the puck well. He's done it at the AHL level. He's pushed the puck well and has been productive. It's just about being able to figure it out at the next level. If you look at the AHL in 69 career games, he has 35 points. I'm including <clears throat> 10 points in 13 games last season at that level. So he's been able to produce. He's also looked better on both ends at the AHL level through watching through AHL TV. And um, he's somebody that definitely looks like how the scouting report was said that he would look in the NHL at this point of his career. But some guys move slower. Some guys don't develop his career. We just saw Jared Tenorti be able to find himself as a journeyman in recent years. We're just seeing Carson Soucy develop into a good defenseman. Like, he was already a solid defenseman his entire career, but now he's becoming a good to a really good consistent defenseman. He did that in his late 20s and now into his early 30s, so I think you have to be able to be patient with certain guys, and that's what you have to be with Dennis Shalowski. Um, You're going to have to be patient with him and just kind of wait for him to develop, because in 104 career games with Detroit, he does only have 27 points, so obviously you're waiting here. This is a one of those small pickups, I think, by the Washington Capitals that has a chance to be one of those things at the end of the season, like some of the other waiver claim videos I did for my channel already, to be one of those bigger moves, to be one of those moves that actually has more of an impact than people think coming in, because Dennis Shalowski was a talented guy when Detroit picked him in the draft. He couldn't figure it out there. He didn't make his way into the lineup that they did pick pretty defensive and send it there in Seattle, so he didn't make his way in there as a more offensively inclined guy that is not being able to figure out the other end as well in the NHL. So let's see how he's able to do it in Peter Laviolette's system. I think he will use him eventually because you're going to want to see what you have in him as long as he looks good in practice when you're going through drills and you're doing everything and he looks good in terms of getting integrated in the system. I have a feeling he will be used. This is a pickup that is a nice small pickup that has a chance to become a bigger pickup. And in correspondence, um, they learned Beck uh, Malenston to the Hershey Bears while picking up Dennis Shalowski, the forward. And I think Solowski going to add a good bit of depth to the defense. He's not going to do much more than that at first because he hasn't proven himself fully yet. But I liked this guy in Detroit when he got drafted. He looked solid when he first came in, then kind of just went into that big stall tactic period and wasn't able to figure it out in Detroit and then didn't obviously make the Kraken roster and then got claimed here by the Washington Capitals. He's a talented young defenseman. Those are the guys that... Obviously, the guys that get claimed are the guys that other organizations think they can use or figure out or put in a better spot to succeed themselves. So I'm thinking that's what the Capitals are thinking here, because if he does work out well, Justin Schultz is obviously a good body, big body defenseman that can block shots and also just defend well. He would work the best just in terms of what both of their games profile as with Justin Schultz compared to TVR, that is two right-handers, and compared to Matt Irwin, who is another just more solid on the defensive end defenseman's not going to add much on offense. Shalowski has the ability to do that, so he would actually care the best if it works out. That's why I'm saying this has a chance to become a small move now that on the onset that then becomes a bigger move over time. So I hope you all enjoyed this video on Dennis Shalowski being claimed by the Washington Capitals. Subscribe down below if you enjoy the content or up above on the easy-to-use widget. Stay safe out there, everybody, and enjoy the NHL season. Peace out.